Hi, I'm Michael Goodlin with FiddlerShop.com, and when it comes to orchestra mutes, there are a handful of options to choose from. Quite literally. All of the mutes do a perfectly fine job in dampening the sound the appropriate amount when you're playing an orchestra or when your music calls for it. The only variables are how much they cost, how likely they are to fall off and lose them, or how easy they are to put on and off the bridge, and also how they affect the sound of your instrument when they're not in use, like if they buzz or rattle or if they change the sound at all. So let's take a look. To get things started, let's look at the two tort mutes. These are some of my favorite choices for mutes. The very simple and affordable options, and they do a pretty good job of staying out of the way when they're not in use. Sometimes they will sort of rattle around and buzz a little bit. It's usually fixable if you just make sure that they're backed up against the tailpiece as far as possible. The single one does a little bit better of a job because you can either kind of push it down on the string or also tilt it to make sure that it's, it stays secure. The only downside to these mutes is that it does take a split second longer to apply these mutes because you have to push it down once you slide it up and likewise you have to pull it up to remove it and also that can be a little bit noisy if you haven't greased your mute. Just a little bit of body sweat will do the trick. And if you have to play an opera and do that a hundred times in a night, those little microaggressions could add up. And so that's why there are other options for mutes. The Spectre Mute by Super Sensitive is a fantastic mute because it simplifies the process of putting the mute on and off. You simply have to push it forwards to apply it and pull it backwards to remove it. When the mute is not in use, it stays put by being pinched between the A and the D strings. It's a very subtle and unobtrusive mute and it doesn't rattle around or vibrate at all while you're practicing. On my instrument though, it kind of affected the sound a little bit too much because it pressed on the D and the A string to the point that I didn't really like to use it if I was just practicing or playing solo. But in orchestra, it's a great mute. The Roth Sia Mute, which is sometimes just called the Wire Mute, is a lot like the Spectre Mute and it's very simple to apply. You just slide it forward. To remove it, you just slide it backwards. And it doesn't rattle around, doesn't vibrate at all when it's not in use. I'm not the most in love with this because it's a little harsh on the backs of the strings and the windings because it's kind of grinding a little bit every time you slide it on or slide it off. Also, it kind of requires an associate's degree in mechanical engineering to get it on in the first place, but if you're not happy with the other options, it is another good mute. A newer mute on the market is the Weissmeyer Leather Mute, and as the name suggests, it is made of leather, which just gives the mute a sort of a different sound, some different overtones than all the rubber mutes that I just previously talked about. It's a bit of a hybrid between an orchestra mute and a practice mute because it has two functions. To get started, you can just uh, leave it in sort of a rest position by just inserting it onto the strings like that. To apply it in an orchestra setting, you just slide up against the bridge so that it's flush with the bridge. To use it to its full capacity, you can slide it on top of the bridge, much like you would a practice mute, for a different sound. It is an interesting option because of that unique sound that you get and also the two different uses of it. I'm a little skeptical of it because I think it might be a little too easy to fall off when it's in rest position. And also when it is in rest position, it's touching all four of the strings. So I think that would dampen some of the vibrations of the strings when it's not in use. So those are some of the options for orchestra mutes. You can pick one or 10 of them up at fiddlershop.com. Thanks for watching.